Welcome back to the channel. I'm Spider J, and I am back with a new reaction video, which was published by Marvel Entertainment. The MCU began in 2008 with the first Iron Man, and then came the Incredible Hulk, then uh, Iron Man 2, the first Thor, Captain America, the first Avenger, and then the Avengers, and then uh, Thor, the Dark World, and Iron Man 3, and then in 2014, uh, it was Captain America, the Winter Soldier, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. Five hours later. And then in 2015 was Ant-Man and Avengers Age of Ultron. In 2016 it was Captain America Civil War and uh, Doctor Strange. And then 2017 was Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, Spider-Man Homecoming, and Thor Ragnarok. And uh, then 2018, the beginning of 2018, February 2018, it was Black Panther. And then obviously Infinity War, uh, which soon followed um, Ant-Man and the Wasp. And still have a lot more movies planned. So just all that in the last 10 years, that's pretty insane. And for this franchise to keep, um, to, and for this franchise to keep going strong, it's pretty insane and doesn't look like it's gonna you know, slow down anytime soon. So yeah, let's see this little uh, tribute of Marvel Studios and the MCU. It's been a decade of signs and wonders. 10 years. It's pretty extraordinary. It is just the most remarkable achievement. It's a very that black conscious logo. act to go and make a motion picture, let alone think about launching and sustaining a, a cinematic That's crazy. Universe. I mean, nobody even heard of that five, six years ago. I'm Peter, by the way. Doctor Strange. Oh, you're using the made-up names. Pretty awesome to see this yeah. collective, isn't it? Iron Man 1, of it. two it's Avengers it's Infinity War. Just think, think about that. That's pretty insane. Everyone deserves to be there. You know, everyone has fought for their place in the MCU. It's such an amazingly humble group of people, and everyone's easy to work with that are team players. Surprise! This will be such fun. Yeah. I love all these actors. They've made it so And fun. then the next snap. It's, it's like Spoilers, by the way. Really, we're all having fun, and we're really allowed to be the best versions of whatever these giant movies are. given a set of circumstances and a script and you go try to put your secret sauce on that and make it fun and entertaining and I think what's extraordinary is how that baton has been passed in such a magnanimous way from all these franchises I am oh, Steve Rogers. I kind of wish they had a now Caps together. actual shield it's just so epic are you yawning classic tracks to have created these different worlds and made them so sort of full and rich and then bring them all together. Yeah, that was intense. I thought they were going to get it off of it. It's so great. It's really been 10 years in the making. It is a very, very unique film. I'm glad it's worked out this way because we have been working our asses off for a while. We've come this far, 19 years. It's pretty fun to make those movies. Still be going and still have people wanting it and still be doing something that's new and profound and culturally yeah. significant that's a dream come true oh, that's it. so yeah guys 10 years of the Marvel Cinematic Universe that's a pretty long time for a franchise and the fact that it's not even over yet and I don't think it'll ever really be over um, obviously next year uh, with uh, Infinity War Part 2 or whatever it's called, that's going to be the end of, you know, the first chapter of the MCU. You know, you're going to have a lot of the main Avengers probably not going to make it, um, unfortunately. Probably, I think Iron Man might not make it, but this franchise is honestly a dream come true for me as a Marvel fan. You know, I've been a Marvel fan ever since I was, you know, three, four years old. Yeah, to have all these characters in a live action film interact with each other and fight together and it's it's just insane. And uh it's pretty awesome to watch. And I can't wait for, you know, all the movies to come. Uh Spider Man Far From Home in twenty nineteen. I really can't wait for that. So yeah guys, let me know uh your thoughts on the MCU, uh and comment down your favorite moments of the MCU so far. One of my favorite moments is probably the the Battle of New York when all the heroes, you know, come together. Um that was probably one of the most epic 
you know, moments of this franchise. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. We're almost at 200 subscribers right now, so that'd be awesome if you could, you know, help us get to that little milestone. And that concludes this little reaction. So I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.